Hello, I'm Patrick Dooley, the Senior Product Manager for GitLab's ecosystem team, and this is our 13.6 kickoff. I want to talk a little bit about the work that we'll be doing over the next month, and this is going to be focused on JIRA. So the first issue that we're talking about today is improving the UX for the initial setup of our Connect application in the Atlassian Marketplace. So this is the listing page, gitlab.com for Jira Cloud. We just shipped a bunch of improvements to this page, trying to make it a lot more clear what it is, how to use it, how to set it up. But there are some problems with the application itself. And so here's an epic that we have with 14 issues in it to, to work on this initial setup experience. But specifically in 13.6, one of the ones that we're looking at adding is improving the error message when you add a namespace. So you can see a demo that I recorded here. When you add a thing, it just gives you this kind of generic invalid namespace error, which doesn't tell you a lot or how to use it. Additionally, we want to add a more user-friendly way to select those namespaces. This is the same demo. Um, but showing a user a list instead that can auto-complete of those namespaces so it's clear when you're adding a namespace to Jira, what namespaces do you have access to? Um, that's a big question, especially for, for those who aren't familiar with the term. Uh, that's a bit of a, 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 a jargon term, right? Uh, a namespace is really familiar for some people, but for many, uh, it's kind of confusing. So showing what namespaces are available will make that a lot better. Additionally, we want to be able to sync existing MR data when a namespace is added to the Jira Connect app. Uh, there are a couple of pieces here. So one, uh, we want to be able to sync this merge request data in general. Uh, it doesn't do a good job picking up all of that existing data. So we need the ability to add that. So the first step is getting that synced when the namespace is added to the Connect app. That'll also allow us to do other things like allowing a manual data sync as well. So that, uh, that integration will allow you to show all of your MR data inside Jira. So they have a component in that UI called the developer panel. And in the developer panel, it shows you a number of different pieces. So you, you can see the branch data, like the commits, the merge requests. Uh, we're also adding build information and feature flag information and deployment information over the next few milestones. So being able to sync the merge request data in would be awesome. And finally, we're also adding monthly active user data for ecosystem's overall usage ping. So we have a lot of different pieces in the usage ping payload, uh, specifically tracking all of the different installations of various integrations. Now, this is anonymized data. We're just seeing a count of the number of integrations that are active. But what we want to see is how many users are using those integrations, right? Because integrations are with a project. So knowing how many, in this case, Jira projects have been, or Jira integrations have been added to projects is awesome, but how many users are on each of those projects? If it's only one user per project, which is probably not the case, but if it's only one user per project versus a thousand users per project, like that makes a really big difference in how many people are actually using these things. So that's it for 13.6. Can't wait to see you in 13.7 and have a great day.